Roundabout Theatre Company is celebrating its 50th anniversary with the Broadway revival of She Loves Me. The romantic musical comedy, which first debuted in 1963, is back with a star-studded cast. Set in 1934 Budapest, it's a heartwarming story about two parfumery clerks finding love the good old-fashioned way. The spectacular set is also a star in its own right. It was designed by famed architect David Rockwell. And guess what? He invited me to the show for a tour. So David, this is a perspective not a lot of people get. Tell me a little bit about the set, She Loves Me. This set does many things. It sets a character of a period in time that was sort of an explosion of color. We started out by wanting to create the world of Budapest with Marachek's perfumery as a three-dimensional object that the characters move around. We had a chance to have that story open up automation-wise do things that we've never had a chance to do before. And emotionally, I think the cast feels that. The cast yeah. feels the reality of that set breathing and opening. I have to say that, you know, from the audience, it looks so much different yeah. on stage because the scale. And as we walk back, you'll see that there's a lot of dimensional detail. So this yeah. forced perspective kind of moves the audience back. Do you want to take a peek inside the perfumery? I really do. Let's go look. So, Mr. Marichuk unlocks it, and then it opens up. Wow, oh, it's so tiny. What uh -huh. feels like one building yeah. is actually four separate pieces that dance and move throughout the show. Okay. So can we open it up? Let's do that. That would be great. Okay. Should we watch it from the house? Okay. I see it unfolding. It's like Barbie's tree folks. <laughs> you see the counters moving down. It's so inviting. Let's go all the detail, I mean, because not everybody sees all of these little details from the seats, but you did not leave anything out. Seapost spends a lot of time here. Each one of these pieces gives him something to do. So we found someone to cast these resin perfume bottles, and then we made these small tags that go on each one. Here you can see the guide tracks. It's very complicated. So the set's like a giant transformer. Yeah. And there's many different locations throughout the musical. One of them is the workroom. Don't mean to intrude. Here we so go. these retract, Here we go. these separate, and this is coming down and is gonna end up right in our faces. Is it weird that I just got chills while that was moving? Me too. I've never been up here when this does that. Wow! Bam! That was really exciting. Isn't that cool? <laughs> One of the things about that transition is it puts the action right in the audience's lap. Yes. Look at all this. David, what do you think? I think I'm glad I sit out there. <laughs> Can we see the store one more time? I would love that. Okay. And here it goes. And as they come to a resting position, these pieces open up and the store breathes open again. I love that. I love that too. What an experience to be on the stage, to see it all move, to see everything up close and personal. This has been such a great day. David, thank you so much for giving me the ins and outs of the She Loves Me set. That was a thrill. Thanks for coming and visiting.